That's the chic, baby. Wrestling. These these fuckers in Cheltenham don't know class when they see it. Tell them, sheep. I do appreciate that tactic. I know what that's all about. Don't don't hesitate. Don't let them wait. Get in there while the back's turned and just get on top. That's what it's all about. Yeah, tell them, Sheik. Yeah. Welcome back, Eddie. Oh, Yeston's pissed. So we have two we have two blokes here, and they're heavyweights. And when you take a look at both these guys, they're both, I mean, the phrase would probably be built to like brick shit houses. Oh yes, similar yeah. to Eddie Ryan, yesterday's the very, very first show I saw. I think Yeston might have a bit of a weight advantage on him. I think so too. Anyone who's been following Yeston, or clothesline from Yeston there, to the Sheik. I think anyone who's been following Yeston will know. Oh. Power slam to the Sheik from Yeston. Hitting the lights as well. Extra little bit of damage to the ankle, the Sheik. Yesterday didn't give a fuck. Yesterday, I've seen him since the very first show in Cheltenham. Oh, really? Another one from Another the first one. show. He's always been great. Always been amazing. Yesterday, Reese. With a long stalling suplex. Oh. Boom. Those sharp eyed out there might notice that the uh, trunks of Yesterday are referring to the Reese's Pieces chocolate. Like, no, no sponsorship involved. Obviously, you know, yeah. I thought perception just from all the chat. Other chocolates are available. Other chocolates are available and we uh, are equal to all chocolates really. Uh, but, but again, get back on track. Yestin grabbing the Sheik. Oh, a chop. Doesn't affect Yestin. Doesn't affect him. Anyone who's been following Yestin knows this is the man. His mind is behind a lot of the fitness in the wrestling. Yes. There's a lot of people subscribing to old Yestin's fitness plans. Yeah. Oh, 
big just shot right to the mouth. Shot to the jaw of the Sheik. And another one. I can't tell if it's a close fist or not. Oh, it's always a grey area outside. Here. Let's just main event. Let's go with it. it. Let him go with it. Ref's discretion. That chop, that last chop from yesterday was more of a thud. He didn't even bother just chopping. That was pure. That was a strike to the chest. And you know, both Sheik and Yeston don't mind where they fight. I just want to fight. Cunning. Going down, putting some extra power into that. Whip. Very, very smart wrestling. I think that might be my commentary bit. Whenever I say whip, I say whip. I like it. That's my oh my god. <laughs> and, and I just do whip yeah. uh, or the odd win it'll get boring after a while he whips he whips yes back into the rope does our Sheik Sheik looking to do like what we saw with Lee Hunt earlier on controlling the pace a little bit here he's got the edge don't rush in and make any mistakes he's enjoying whipping him back and forth use those turnbuckles oh, oh. Like a big clothesline yes was able to slow the pace down a bit and use that to get some momentum back in clothesline they've both gone over Cactus oh my god and Shays and Mick Foley one of my faves bang bang did Yeston land on his feet? I think he did. Yeston may be I slightly taller than Sheik, but Sheik's got very, very they're both, long They're both very tall. What's like 6'4", six, 6'5"? Six, no! Oh, Jesus! Okay. That might have been the most hardcore thing I've ever seen Yeston do. Yeston has stepped up his game since the pandemic. He's like, wow. Oh, he's angrier as well. Is. Maybe he's hangrier. There we go. He some chocolate. A lot of competition lately. He's probably been cutting a lot. He's hungry, baby. And again, go. oh! You never want to hear the sound of skin on brick. No, skin on brick with a bit of wood and glass. Horrible. They're going to put him back in the ring. I don't even know if... Uh, Oh, Rory, Look the ref at is straight, great oh. press right into the ring. And as we've established, he's no smaller man. So no. He pick him up above his head like that. Oh, he just had a beer. Drinking on the job. Tut, tut. I want to point out as well, Sheik's got some sick as fuck footwear. Check it out. Sick. Oh, yeah. All the jacks on top of there we go. Thank you. Europeans from Sheik. Absolute pleasure, Eddie. Thank you. You know what? I'm going to say it. Fully on board with the van now. I was happy for you in your match. I was supporting you. But I lost my man. You did. And, oh, big Russian legs. Oh, Sheik. Oh, that was lovely. That's what I mean. The very long legs of the Sheik help him bounce back. So I stringy. love that version of the Russian leg sweep. Maybe it's the Middle East uh, leg sweep. Very good, maybe it is. Very good shout. Where Tell him, Sheik. Okay, that's what it means. Sheik's not all in proportion. Yeah. Longer legs, long body, long arms. Yes, the Reeks is very long body, slightly shorter legs. Yesterday he's got that, he's like, he's like, he's definitely, he's definitely rocking the power advantage here, no question. Yes, he's got the power advantage, but here, right, Sheik, working the lower back. This is a good tactic. Everything, is he going to flip up? Yes! And speaking of Irish Whip, here we go. Oh, and there we go, working the back again. Sheik as a, as a tactic, as a strategy. And again, yes, he can't help but touch his back, just giving away his target. I sometimes get confused between tactics and strategy. Does anybody really know the difference? I think strategy is what you planned before. This might be why I lost. <laughs> uh, it probably is, actually. Uh, it was very close, though. It was fucking close. <laughs> Look at him there, just showing up. Shaking his boot. Giving that, that boot shake. Giving that. Him, I can do this. I can play with you. I can control you. Yeah. Like I am owning you right now. That's what Shake said. That's what Shake said. That's quite good. Cheltenham, you're, you're going up a little bit. Oh, there you 
go. That was like coming up to the mid upper back. Oh, yes, Reese's pieces. One of the crowd has caught on. Again, no, no sponsorship, no affiliation. Just a uh, perception for myself. Again, we treat all chocolates. She went to a stop right into a headlock. Very smartly. Boom! Oh yeah, and a little head there. She can move. And do you know what? I think this is this, uh, as we say, we point out, he's a bit more spelt yeah. than Yestin. He's got that mobility that maybe Yestin's uh, not... Oh, oh, Yestin's got the power. Sheik's got the, uh, the mobility edge. But, yeah, but he's, you know, he is hot shot in a minute. And at the end of the day, he should probably focus less on... He's a showman, you know? He wants, he's a showman. He wants to make his point. Look at that. And again, the long arms will pull back. Energy. The leverage is gone now. Yestin's pumping up the energy. His lower back fighting through. You can tell it's caused him a little bit of grief. Oh. He's able to get Sheik off of him by grabbing him into the turn by the Let me go to the next level. Oh. Oh. Sheik is clever. He's one step He's setting things up to come back. Every kick Yestin's got Oh, did you see that? Going straight back into it. He's wrenching the neck, but he's also putting pressure on the lower back here. Yes, which has worked up to this point. Ring did move. That's what happens you get two heavyweights, two horses fighting in there. Yeah. Yestin kicks the clothesline away and delivers one of his own. Gut wrench, power bomb maybe. Oh, oh no, gut wrench suplex. Dead, a deadlift uh, gut wrench suplex. With his back as well. With his back he's fighting through the pain. He's moving him over, he's aware of the light. Ring awareness, ring awareness. Yes, yes, then teasing a spear here. He asked everybody who wanted a spear. I don't know what the answer was. I think they want a fucking spear. And if they don't want it, then they don't know it yet. Oh. Maybe she I think, more of a reach. I think when Yestin said to the crowd, do you want a spear? I think she thought he's going to try and spear me now. <laughs> so he's like, I'll just counter that. So big mistake by Yestin there. You want to get the crowd behind you to get some answers. Can be a disadvantage. Yeah. Maybe if he said, oh, oh there's a spear of his own. There's a spear of his own. Maybe say, do you want a spear? Two. Maybe say, do you want a spear? And then go for a cutter. There we go. I'm going to use that tactic. We are a good team. I'm going to use that tactic next time. I'm going to say, do you want a spear, Cheltenham, you cunt? And then they're going to say, yeah. And I'll be like, have an RKO instead. You mean, I'll cut her. It's not an RKO. It's a cutter. Yeah. In fact, the first name of the cutter was Jaws of, Into the Jaws of the Golden Lion. That's my official name of my cutter. Into the Jaws of the Golden Lion. She's walking off. She, she don't need this. She's having a beer. Mark's joining us. And do you know what? Like, I don't, like, she didn't really need to get back in. He's got the championship advantage. It's a strange fucking rule, but that's how it goes in wrestling. You get counted out, you keep the belt. Fuck it, take the easy yeah. keep. Yeah. Retention. There we go. On the shoulders. Yeah. So beautiful. Oh! oh, oh going to an F5. What's the non, what's the non, uh, 
Like, there's another name for that, I think. Cyclone. There you go, Eddie. You do. Oh, yeah. That's where all the move names are. And that looked like, if from memory serves, that looked like Cyclone 3. <laughs> Oh, there he goes with that spinning uh, clothesline. And another, and another beautiful spear from the shake. What's he going for? Uh, Yeston keeps getting up, man. He's a beast. Oh, Death Valley Driver! That might be it. That's one. That's two. That's that three! Was all it took. That was all it took. And you notice it was, it was, it, it, the momentum turned at the end when Shake, Shake dropped him down over the ropes. I let you do your thing, Eddie. It's been an absolute pleasure, Eddie. Thank you, you for having thank me. Thank you so much. And thank you, everybody, the for brand. watching. Support the brand, everyone. Support the brand. Support the brand, August Jackson. But, but also support the shake who wins this contest, retaining and still, and still, your Southwest champion.